love it. Very nice. Nice meeting you. This is a beautiful house in the Maria. Kathy's calling us. Let's okay. go. Come right on inside. Come on, guys. Okay, so I'm Kathy. This and, is I'm, Joe. and I'm Joe Dorison, and we've been involved with Jewish Family Service for over 20 years. And we recently met the Somali family about five months ago. They got off a plane, and we met them, and they basically had nothing. And um, well, they had a backpack. A backpack, and we gave them all stuffed animals. And we kind of bonded with them right away. And Jewish Family Service set them up in an apartment and set them up with other families to all get to know each other. We've been going to the fam visit the family for the past five months. Kathy and I are very excited because finally we can talk to each other and and tell each other what, what we're thinking of. We are so happy to come to your house. Oh. We're happy to have you. Kathleen <laughs> when, when we all went, when Kathy and I went to the airport and met you, our eyes and lives opened up to see you all. And we are so happy and grateful the way you welcome us and what you did for us. Uh, you, you, you are all family. We become a family. Oh, they, will, they, will, they want to go to swimming first. Oh, good. So let's go swimming. Yeah, they, they are excited to swim. The difference like now since being here for five, five years, like what, what did they think like, you know? He said, we came from a place that we didn't have the necessity, the basics. We didn't have anything. Basic necessity we didn't have. And when we came and we see this beautiful country, the houses they built, the, everything they have, how, how many cars they have. He said, we were like surprised and like, wow, look at these people, how hard they work and build this, their country. Look. Yeah. You know, take for granted. Yeah. We take for granted all the time. So, I, I, you know, you yeah. have to put yourself in other people's shoes. That, you know, True. we're very lucky sometimes, you know. So, True. Yeah. Mohammed said, um, we are so grateful how America, American government and American people help us and brought us from nowhere to this uh, beautiful place. And, um, we are so appreciative and so thankful and we pray for them and we pray for the people we left behind. And we hope, you know, somebody yeah, yeah. give them a hand yeah, to go and save. Mohammed said, um, when we were um, getting orientation about this country, about America and what to expect, he said, um, one of the things it impacted me was um, when you go to America, you will be one of them. Nobody um, belongs to America. You will be part of Americans. You will be part of those people. And I was wondering, how come I'm new? I'm just coming to their country and I will be one of them? And he said, I was like disbelief. I wasn't sure. But when I came, I see I'm one of them now. I feel like, okay, I belong here too. So tonight was the first time we got to have a translator talk to them and in a few minutes they're going to get in the swimming pool for the first time ever. They said that they've been in a little bit of water in a corner of some little river or pond years ago mm -hmm. and uh, I've got to go get my bathing suit on because I'm going in with them. Bikini underneath there. <laughs>